All right, guys, welcome to Unit Tutorials in under two minutes here. I was doing a minute, but I think it's a little too short on time here. I think two minutes will be an express tutorial here, but it should still give you enough time to get in everything I want to say here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do first right click here. We're going to set up a UI here. I'm going to set up a text element from here. Let's just name this text right now here. Let's make this text say something like new text. That's good enough for me here. And let's make it white just so we can see here. Okay. And we're going to make it a little bigger just so we can see it. So in this tutorial here, we're going to work on changing text programmatically with a script from here. Okay. Size 80. And let's make it centered and centered here. Okay. I have a script from here. The script doesn't have anything in it. It's a brand new script here. Let's go ahead and open this thing up here. I'm going to go ahead and remove the update method. Now I want to include one namespace here. This is going to be using Unity Engine. Dot UI. Okay. Now on the, uh, I'm sorry, above it, we're going to clear one public variable here. We're going to say public, capital T for text for the type here, and then lowercase t for text for the name. Okay. Now we're going to say text dot text here, and the set is equal to something like hello world. Okay. Very simple from there. Okay. Let's say this. So this is where it kind of confused me at first here. We're saying text dot text here. The reason why, if we go back to Unity here and we go to this text element right from here, and it's going to load here, this is why I needed two minutes here. That's okay here. We're accessing this text uh, component on this game object here, and then we're accessing this text on this text from there, okay? So let's go ahead and drag our script. Let's drag it onto canvas from here. And then we're going to go to the canvas here, and we're going to drag on our text element into this public variable, okay? Let's save it. Let's go ahead and hit play. And we should see the font change, or excuse me, the text change, I should say. So now it's a hello world. So if you guys enjoyed this tutorial here, be sure to check out my Udemy courses here. Links are in the description down below. You guys did fantastic. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Take it easy.